None of us here today can understand why this tragic accident happened. But we can take comfort from the knowledge that the family are together. For eternity. In God's loving embrace. Well, hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Mass on 22 here, back with another episode of Little Hope. Now, the, fam the family fire just happened. I don't know if this is what the funeral was about. I'm assuming so. The Clark family. But, I don't know. Probably could if I just paid attention. Ah, fucking bright. Wait, he lived. Wait, is that him? No, is it? No. <clears throat> is it? I'm not sure. <laughs> so Andrew Taylor. That sounds like a name, Andrew Taylor. John. So we've got pre Professor Who the two hell's students. Daniel? I can't find him. I don't know. Bush, 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 bush. Instead of goofing around, you want to lend a hand here? How is he doing anyway? He doesn't look that serious. Could be concussed. Okay, Professor. Or should I call you doctor now? Why don't you try calling for help? <coughs> Maybe the cops, someone like that. I already tried once, but I'm on it. No. Hey, Andrew, buddy, how you doing? <sighs> Where are we? What happened? Yeah, the bus crashed. We're okay, though, just shaking up. If you say so. I don't remember being in any crash. You're, you're probably in shock. Maybe a mild concussion in there, too. Give yourself some time. Stay here. Don't move. <clears throat> this doesn't sound like a good idea. Oh, oh no, he's checking inside the bus. Okay, that's that seems fine. <sighs> Fucking thing, useless piece of crap. May as well be dead. Okay, take it easy. We'll figure out what to do. Is that a bus driver? No, I don't think so. <sighs> No, 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 it wasn't. The bus driver looked like the fucking detective guy that's in the intro. Daniel. Hey, he looks a bit like, um, he looks like the, a white version Fuck. of Josh from Until Dawn. Now that's it. You wake up from a fucking car crash, car crash, bus crash, and the first thing you say is, where's my phone? Oh, Angela, mature student. Anyone up there? Hey, Daniel, that you? John, good to hear you. Daniel? Taylor, you okay? I'm good. We're fine too, thanks for asking. You okay down there? I'm all right, nothing I can't deal with. Hey, John, any idea what caused the crash? Not sure. Looked like the driver swerved to avoid something in the road. Oh yeah, that's down there, what by the way? Nope. No sign of him. Weird. He isn't up here either. Can you get back up to us? Looks pretty steep. I see a trail down here I could try. Great. Take the trail. Should take you to the road. We can regroup there. That's a plan. See you soon. <coughs> hey, Taylor. Help me get Andrew up on his feet, will ya? Wait. I don't remember anything. Who are you? It's oh. okay. You're concussed. I'm John, you're a college professor. <coughs> we were taking a bus on a field trip, but that didn't work out so well. Crash wasn't on the curriculum. <laughs> uh, we'll find the others, get some help. Think of it as a character building exercise. Whoa. <sighs> Don't do it. Don't try that at me at the book. Teamwork at its finest. No, the fuck off. <laughs> it was so real. Flames all around us. It was grim. That bang on the head must have been a beauty. 
That trail the others are on will come out down the road. We'll meet them there. We should talk this through. Why leave the bus? Not like we have somewhere better to wait. No. We could be here all night. Our best move is to get to the others, then head towards town. See if we can find some help. You're wrong. We stay here, someone will come down this road sooner or later. What is your problem? Relax, will you? I'm just not a girl who likes walking in the dark. The driver's done what we should be doing. Gone into town for help. You're right. Let's go. I'm with you. I'm right? The quicker we get help, the quicker we can all go home. <laughs> Stick close behind me. I can't believe the driver just taking off like that and ditching us. Maybe you didn't realize. Could just be in shock. Where is it? Hey, Daniel, you guys! I am not a guy? What? what are you two doing down there? This trail is the pits, but we're okay. This little detour is ruining my clothes. That's the headline here? Your clothes are ruined? Really? Yeah. Oh, you're a mess. Um, uh, 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 um, life is expensive. Easy. That outfit probably cost more than you earned in your life. My money's in the green. Don't you worry. Money. That's what she wants to hear about. Hey, what's happening here? <laughs> Shut up. Not much. I'm just keeping their spirits up. Daniel, you got your phone? Mine's got zero signal. I guess it fell out during the crash. We staying here all night? We're gonna keep moving. See ya. What is that? Is that claw? Can we just see how he's like he can't remember shit, and so he's following two strangers. So I can analyze this sign for whatever. Abandon hope. Huh. Welcome to Abandon Hope. You know this place? Little Hope? No. I mean, I don't think so. You should both know Little Hope. Try to get out of here, why should I? Why should I have heard of this place? Seriously, this place is steeped in history. Fascinating stuff. How do you know all this stuff anyway? <laughs> I'm a professional academic. I read books, unlike some. <laughs> Easy, Einstein. I can match everything you got with just a smartphone. Yeah. Well, your phone isn't so smart without a signal. He's got a point. Okay, anything else shining? Hmm. Good to see you two, finally. Everything okay? Sure. We took the scenic route. You sure as hell took your own right. sweet time. He's getting worried. I bet you were. This gate is chained. We can't get through. Look around. See if there's anything we can use to break it. Think this'll do it? Ready? I'll push hard from my side. Ready. Three, two, one, push. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Great job, you two. I thought I was gonna have to click X for much longer. Great. What's the plan now? Head into town, see if we can get help. You know where town is? Sure, we're near Little Hope. Sounds like a fun place. Funnily enough, Little Hope does have an interesting and dark history. The buff. Bad things happened here. Yeah, the the buff fucking rude, so no. Which you are dying to tell us all about. I'm starting not to like you or your attitude. Oh please, I'm, I'm gonna beat you. Yet. You want a little more? <laughs> Try to be civil. Cost nothing. That's rich, given how you badmouth Taylor on the way over. What did she say about me? 
You always get your boyfriend to stick up for you? Try doing it yourself sometime, dear. You're kidding. He is not my boyfriend. What have you been telling her? I didn't say a thing. Keep out of our business, okay? We are wasting valuable time here. Can we please just keep moving? You think this is a solid plan, heading into town? As good as any. I went along with it before, but I'm not so sure now. So what do you want to do? How about you come with me back to the bus? I'm with the professor on this one. Our best play is heading into town <laughs> and getting some help. Um... How about you? You want to head back to the bus with me? Thing is, I think going into town is probably our best shot at finding help. Fine. Come on, Taylor, don't check out on us. It's a bad idea to be out here walking around alone. Come with us. Don't worry about me. I'll flag down the first car I see and come get you all real soon. <laughs> See, I want you to just stay with the group, that's why I picked. Me? I'm not going anywhere with you. What? what? I walked away from you! Uh huh. So you thought better of going it alone then? Why'd you come back? I don't get it. It doesn't make any sense. Lost in a world of her own. What the hell are you playing at? You going or not? Hey, wait, wait, what are you doing? Taylor, look out! What the? What's going on with you? Why do you keep coming back? I'm not coming back! I walk straight out every time! It's like, I don't know, I can't fucking leave or something! Okay, let's try something. We'll all go together. We came from that direction. We must be able to go back that way. I want everyone to stay real close. No stragglers. You want to put us on a kid's line? Okay, okay, I'm coming. <laughs> yeah, I don't like her. Huh. I admit that is a little odd. More than a little. It's not possible. It's just like I've been saying, we are trapped. We can't leave here. Now okay. what can we do? Okay, calm down, breathe. There's a rational explanation for what's happening. Maybe we all died in the crash. Yeah, nice theory, but I'm pretty sure we're all still alive and kicking. Last I checked, you were schooling us on creative writing, not metaphysics. I know who I'd like to be kicking. This is all down to you, this pissy little field trip. Now we're stuck here in little no hope. That is way out of line. Why can I, I had no way of knowing that damn bus would crash. You can't put that on me. Are you for fucking real? Watch your tone, will you? I am doing my best to understand this, just like you and the rest of us. What the fuck? I'm what? sorry. I don't get what's happening to us. I don't understand. It's like yeah, you said, what's the radio a nightmare. It's okay. We're gonna be just fine. We'll figure a way out of this together. Someone else thinks they can do a better job? Step right up! Maybe it isn't real. We have to get out of here right now! I need to think straight! Football coaching. Why the fuck? Can everyone just shut up? This isn't helping us find help or getting us out of here. He's right. Bitching at each other isn't getting us anywhere. We have to work together as a team. Thank you. Now let's be logical. The fog is between us and the bus. There is no fog between us and town, so let's head that way. I don't get how heading further away from the bus helps. There is nothing on the bus we can use to get help. In town, there will be people, a working phone, something. It pains me to admit, but he's right. There is nowhere else we can go except into that damn town. Sounds like a plan to me. You leaving me? Where are you going? Come on, let's go with them. Until we know what's up, we should stick together. I wonder.
That's neat. <laughs> I wanted to see if it would still do it in gameplay. There's a beauty. Oh, oh no 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 wrong one. Why did you say we Okay, yeah, L1 to move faster. You really think that's possible? I saw some cable show about how your brain keeps going for a while after you you know. You die? Forget about it. What they said didn't really stack up. Kitty. It's I don't kitty like cat. the look of that place at all. Anything shiny that I can analyze? Shiny. Oh. I'm not sure this is such a great idea. We should check it out. There could be a phone inside. <gasps> oh, I'll go ahead and take a look around. Go ahead. We'll be right behind you. Why aren't we going with those guys? I know something is up with you. You said I wasn't your boyfriend. Like, what a joke idea that is. <sighs> Are you for real? Our bus gets totaled, we get lost in fog, and your headline is some dumbass label? You're admitting boyfriend is not a label that you use for me. So what the fuck am I then? Uh, fuck, I didn't realize they were actually together. We don't need a label, do we? Come on. So what exactly are we then? I don't know what we are yet. I'm not ready to go public about us yet. I will be soon, I promise. Anything I can do to help convince you I'm the right guy? I need to know 100% I can rely on you. That you'll never let me down. We should catch up with the others. We standing here all night or we going inside? Abandon hope, abandon ship, abandon fucking everything. Hi there. How you doing? Excuse me, but we're uh, looking for our bus driver. What? Have you seen him? <laughs> yeah, that's funny. What is? What's up with the fog outside? It's pretty weird. Yeah, the show is a thick one tonight. So thick it's stopping us from leaving. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know that feeling. You mean you're trapped uh, Sorry too? for busting in like this. Uh, bus we were on crashed a little way back up the road there. We're still a little shaken up. We're still a lot shaken up. You certainly look shook up. I'm Vince. I need a mirror. Maybe there's one here not covered in 20 years of... Sounds like you could use a drink. Better not, thanks. John, black cat bar. Keep a clear head. <clears throat> it's right there if you change your mind. Not for me. Why are you even here? Little Hope sure isn't the town it used to be. What are you doing in here? What happened here? What happened here? The place seems completely deserted. You've barely Little entered Hope the town, John. Like a ghost town. And that fog? Life moves on, you know. But we don't all go with it. Why are you still here? There's a phone in here? There a phone in here? We can use a way of contacting the outside world. There's a phone, but it's been dead for years. You know, maybe there's still one working in town. What is this guy's problem? There's definitely something off about him. <laughs> uh, he's harmless, just had one too many. Let's look around. There must be something here that can help us. Hey, what's Glasgow? See what you can dig up. Uh, he's in a world of his own. A 
An old darts board. I was pretty good back in the day. Stay. Play a little, no problem. I'm gonna take a look around. Yeah, so he's gonna play, okay. <clears throat> At least I'm looking for a way out. What are you Just a quick throw, and then we'll figure out how we're getting out of here. Try for a big double, or... Not my first time, Daniel. Shooting for double 20. Okay, so you can play a little. Still got it. Now for triple 20. Why do you feel like he's gonna give me no fucking time to do this? I don't give him time. Well, almost an Olympic shot after the night we've had. They don't play darts in the Olympics. Bullseye. That is one <laughs> hell of a shot. You did better than Taylor. Let's get back to why we came in here. Wait, wait, wait. can I do it again? Got it. Wait, where's the dartboard? It's too fucking dark in here. Hello, let me talk. <sighs> Got anything else for us on Little Hope? Oh, booze gone in my head. You okay? I'm sure it's just one too many. We both had better days. Can you help us or not? Anything you can do to help us would be greatly appreciated. <laughs> There's no goddamn us. Useful. Oh, Jesus Christ, so many are stuck in things to analyze. Is there anything I can read in this? Whoa! Hmm. I vaguely remember what happened here. Okay. All the factories closed down. Meeting votes for disincorporation. New round of four cluster spells ends. At Little Hope Town Hall on Monday, the last residents of the town met with an emergency manager, Kathy Flint, to vote for disincorporation. Since the, since, since the closure of the Ravadin Textiles factory, a mass exodus has left the town with few inhabitants and empty coffers. Flint was appointed as emergency manager to um, administer public services to the remaining residents. But the last round of ban, ban, bank, sorry, the, the, the last letter's cut out for me, um, for collusions means that the last of the townsfolk are planning to pack up and move on, which will leave Little Hope virtually deserted. What's that last, what's, wait, oh yeah, it still goes down. With no tax revenue coming in, we're faced with no option but to disincorporate, said Flint. It's so sad that these people have seen their town disappear around them. Attempts to... Uh, if I could actually read that. <laughs> if I could actually be bothered. Well, if, if the, the person... If John could be bothered to flip it around. Hey, this way. Oh. Let's get out of here and... You all hear that? I definitely heard something. Then pay attention first. You hear that as well? Come on. Whatever it was came from outside. You really think it's smart to go back outside? Well, there's nothing for us here. We need to move on. Best of luck. Hope you find what you're looking for. I didn't mean that. When the hell did all they get in the bullseye? Fuck! I just clicked X, I didn't think. It's coming from the town. Did the old fucker just lock us out? He was weird, that old guy. 
Sure was something off about him. Why come to Creepy Central just to get a top up? What does that mean? I do. Andrew. Oh, Jesus Christ, it's almost midnight. Huh. Oh, wait a minute. Huh. Whoa! Gun. Pointing at a creature. I thought it was picture frames, Jesus Christ. Okay. Uh, I expect that because was okay. Church, Tilly Johnson, Museum, Tilly Johnson Memorial, Massacre Memorial, Execution Site, Historical Ruin. Where are. No, 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 where are we? One, Bar Buffet. We I are. going the right way. Here. So I'm gonna guess we're gonna go to two or three next. Good to know. I wonder if this play this ends on five. It starts at one, ends at five. Or it ends at one of the museums. I don't know how long this game is either. So until Thursday, the only two videos I will be uploading will be um uh this and Uncharted. Hopefully twice a day, but that's kinda hard um after school starts. Where did they go? What the fuck? Ah. Uh, what? The fuck? What the hell is this thing? Looks like some kind of effigy. A warning, perhaps. Or some other it's... spiritual significance. <laughs> Whatever it is. It gives me the creeps. Me too. I don't know. I'm kind of curious about it. I've heard more than enough. Thank you. Whoa, who was that in the background? Are you the superstitious type? I never believed in this kind of thing. Doesn't seem like you can say the same. A lot of people still really believe in this kind of stuff. After tonight, I thought you might be joining them. Just because other people believe all sorts of garbage doesn't mean I'm about to. Yeah, fine. Guess you're right. Let's uh, catch up with the rest. I don't want to spend any more time with this disgusting oh, thing. A, don't tell me that's them in the fucking distance, that little speck of light. Okay, so some guy ran across... Where the fuck are... Whoa. Go this way? <laughs> oh, you fucker! Alright, you sounded like you were right next to us. Where the fuck are you? Whoa! That was thingy, what's her name? Hey, can you come over here? What's wrong? I just saw someone in the woods. I can't see anyone. I definitely saw someone. 100%. Sorry, I don't buy it. Nobody would be out here at this ungodly hour. Okay. We really should catch up with the others. You two. We need to stick close. What the fuck? What the hell? Did you hear that? Okay, very good. There. Whoever you are, this isn't funny at all. John, where are you? That's shaking, I don't like that. Come on, John, where are you? This isn't funny. <gasps> OK. 
Okay. Moving on. Hey, wait for us. What is that? Hey. Come and check this out. What on earth is that? Uh, heebie jeebies. Not a clue. That's how she's yeah, rope around the neck. That's the girl that hung herself. Good. Fuck off, little girl. <laughs> Wait, yeah. What is your name, sir? I'm Andrew. Andrew? And your name, lady? Who the hell are you? Why are you dressed like that? I am called Mary. I fashioned her with my own hand. She looks just like the one beside you. Would you kindly come play with me? Come play. Come play with what me. What witch's trickery is this now, Mary? I have done nothing. Hold your tongue. I certainly truly are, Mary. Reverend Carver's affection for you will be shaken loose when he learns of your infidelity with the devil. By the fire. What? I, I don't see any fire. I saw oh. him too. Are you okay? This place is all wrong. Whatever happened here, it's over now. You have no clue. You didn't see what we saw. I don't get it. What exactly happened here? This young girl came out of the fog spoke to us maybe the fog has got you confused we're all stressed out stressed my ass i saw a girl dancing right here clear as day said her name was mary looked exactly like the girl in my dream but she talked in this really weird accent was that even american i'm not sure i couldn't place her accent either what have we gotten ourselves into um this kid, oh mary did she want to hurt you No. I don't think she meant to hurt me. Now what? Seems our only option is the road into town. You're kidding me. Got a better idea? Thought not. Weird. Well, what's gonna be up in the tree? Nothing. Okay. Good to know. Oh, thank God. I, I was worried that we were going to have to make this into two parts again. Whew. Well, that escalated rather quickly. Yeah, it did. Everything that one does or doesn't do in one's life will catch up with one eventually. Don't you think? <sighs> yeah. Don't look at me. I can't help you. Remember? We sometimes congratulate ourselves on waking from a troubled dream. It may be so the moment after death. On my travels over many years, I've witnessed many things, seen and heard many beliefs, and there's usually some element of truth in each of them. These unfortunate folk seem to be dealing with forces as yet unexplained. I mean, sinister movements in the forest, spirits from the past, a little girl who may be in trouble. Or maybe she simply is trouble. I, I'm going with that one. Anyway, where are we? Angela isn't getting much tittle-tattle out of Taylor. 
<laughs> no kiss and tell. What about John? The figure of authority, perhaps? Yeah. Or perhaps he represents something else. And then there's Andrew. Somewhat confused, I think. A bump to the head can do that. Mm -hmm. Let me reassure you. You help make some decisions that will be valued later on. So far, so good. You're doing well. Okay. That fellow in the bar. He was less than helpful. More than a little rude, if you ask me. Clearly something disturbing on his mind. Enough. There's something not quite right in Little Hope. And souls may be in peril. Off you go again. See if you can lift the fog. Find the bus driver. Hmm. Okay. Well, I'm going to leave that episode here. Please drop a like and I'll hope to see you in the next episode. <laughs>